Hello again everyone, we are Gaming by Gaslight and welcome back to Airships Conquer the Skies. When we last played off, we went for the tutorial and did a couple of simple missions. But let's actually play the conquest mode because that's kind of like the real bread and butter of the game. Alright, we will call our, uh, our first starting city Gas... Gaslight... We'll just call it Gaslight. Bit, we'll call it Big Gaslight. Why not? Because we're big and we are also a Gaslight. There we go. Begin! Alright, so Big Gaslight is your home city. Cities that are yours ha have your flag. Each city you conquer gives you additional income, but must also be defended. Alright, sounds cool. Uh, clickety. Oh, wait, probably wants me to actually click on the city first. Okay. Moving, moving on. I swear I was literally just playing this and it was like, there we go, okay. It was perfectly fine, so I'm not entirely sure what uh, the deal was. Build ship. I mean, we don't really have much money, so we're not gonna build any ships just yet. Ah yes, to build up your fleet, you may want to construct another airship. Go click on your home city, then choose build a ship, select a ship within your budget, name it, and click OK. Construction will begin, and once complete, your new ship will join the fleet. Ah, here we go. You can control the speed of the game using these controls. You can pause the game again at any time. Now it's time to scout your first conquest. Send a spy to this nearby city. And yes, okay, so spy, send spy. Then we'll just let time pass by, we'll build up some money, we'll build another ship. Life will be good. We don't want to go too fast. Your spy is now set up and reporting from Ulfar. Following information has become available. The income it produces, the size of its shipyard, which determines how quickly it can build new ships. Finally, the level of its secret uh, bleh, the level of its secret police, which determines how susceptible it is to bribery and sabotage. If you click on the city, you can choose View City, look at its defenses and the garrison. Alright, that's that's pretty heavily defended. It's only got the one ship right now. 0% chance of a bribe. Alright, interesting. So we're not we're not conquering the city for a while, is what I'm getting from this. Alright. Using spies, you can determine what kind of fleet you need to conquer a city. Once your fleet is ready, select it. Cities your fleet can reach to invade now have an invade button. Click invade will send all selected ships to invade the city. Or now invade the city and ready yourself for combat. To be honest, it seems far far away than this city right here. Maybe I would rather send a spy over here. Oh, and also probably build a ship. Let's see, what do we want to build? We'll sort by cost. Uh, let's see, the HMS Cranium has a, ra a simple ram, so it's basically a ramming ship. It's got some grenades as well. Not bad. Uh, the bat, the coyote, the deathly wind, which has a marine barrack. So this one is designed basically... Oh, it's got some grenades too, but it seems like it's mostly here for capturing enemy ships, which we might actually want in order to, uh, put, you know, get stuff done. We'll, uh, we'll let time just kind of pass by for a little bit, save some money. Oh, oh god. The enemy fleet is moving to invade one of your cities. Make sure it's well defended. To strengthen it, move your fleets there or build additional defensive buildings. Okay, so it's going to Catwick. Is right here. Let's look at the defenses. Not that many defenses, to be honest with you. Um, let's see here. Can we build a building? Defensive structure... The, the Silent Watcher. We act, Do we actually have the money for this? The answer is maybe. Do we have anything that's just like, that shoots directly up? That would probably be more useful. Alright, so we don't have access to the flak cannon yet, so this would be the, probably the most useful. Like, just offhand. Um, hmm. You know what, let's, let's actually, uh... We will build the, uh, heap of crows. I think these guys have a reasonable, yeah, they have a fairly reasonable angle of attack, I think. So, oh god, it's actually got to build. 
Okay, and uh, how much money do we still have? We should build in Big Gaslight another ship, I guess. No, we could build a land ship. Let's build a, a shooty ship. I, I did want the Deathly win, but a Crisodi maybe? I mean, it's it's fairly cheap. All right, we'll, we'll start building that. We'll, we'll just call it what it is now, and we will move here to defend our... Uh... Oh, God. Is this guy coming in as well? Your enemy fleet is moving to invade one of your cities. Crapple. They have no time to defend both of them. In fact, this one's coming in much faster. Yeah. Hmm. All right, well. Oh, and it's leaving. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Never mind. Oh, no, it is. There. Damn it. That's unfortunate. I'm going to lose my city, aren't I? And unless we can break these uh, balloons off before it reaches us. Otherwise, we have no chance. Man, and things like covered in steel. All right, it's, it's, it, it is inexplicable. Oh, I guess its uh, range of fire requires it to sort of be in shooty range of us. Oh my god, is it like releasing little things or is that just background stuff? I mean, if we can take these out and it goes down, then we're, we're good. Come on. Come on, take out the floaty stuff. Oh my god, it's, it's going down. Also, ho hold on here, hold on. Oh, I, I can't access the options menu from here. But once we can, I'm gonna lower the sound effects a little bit. Come on, come on. Can I, can I focus fire on a specific part? These are actually doing something, aren't they? Oh, oh, it's going down. I mean, we might have a chance here. Oh, God. Oh, the humanity! Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Come on, take out the cannons. Focus on the cannons, dang it! Oh, Lord. Come on. Come on, you can do it! Like, I mean, technically you'd figure this thing would be disabled by now. But apparently it's not that easy. It, it has stopped shooting, though. I don't, I don't even know. Though, th this is kind of annoying, like these little things. Like, like, surely these things don't have the, um... Like, the, um, the logistics to keep this up when, like, the mothership is down. I've got to be honest, that's kind of some bullshit there. In my personal opinion, is this thing, like, actually, uh, coming back? Maybe. Alright, let, let's invade. We gotta, we gotta take our ship back. I swear to God, if this ship is, like, back in one piece, I'm gonna be so, so terribly... Oh, look at that. They don't even really have defenses. All right, let's, uh, s let's start this thing. I mean, yeah, it, they don't have, they don't have anything to shoot at me with. Like, if, if this thing can't shoot, surely it should just count as me having one already, right? What, what, what is shooting at me? Oh, no, that's us shooting at them. Never mind. I don't suppose I could just, like, have my guys move in and... Let's land the ship. Because, like, if this thing is disabled, how... Um... Alright, I guess that's, uh... I guess that's not happening, is it? Like, this is disabled, so why do I even have to fight it? Wait, how am I on fire? Who, who is shooting at me? Or wait, are we actually on fire or is that just, uh...
Yeah, like, this confuses me a little bit, I have to admit. Like, why do I have to fight this when it's pretty... When it's pretty clear that they've got nothing to fight me... There we go. Yeah, that was... That was weird as all heck. Alright, let's view their city. You know, this city actually looks really easy to... Invade. I mean, it's got a lot of armor. But it's not... It doesn't have, like, a terribly great amount of guns. And I'm sure if we sent in our marines, we could just, like, capture the... Capture the building itself, possibly. Anyway, let's, uh... Let's have this move over to Kudir. Yeah. Oh, this is our city as well. I mean, I guess I should also be trying to save up money so that we can acquire some stuff. Also, if we go down to defenses... Okay, we don't have the money to, to repair it yet, but we'll get to that. Also, what is this guy doing? Uh, is he in... He's invading some of them. All right. Let us invade... Can, can we see the little city? Maybe. But, you know, it's a little city. Like, it's one of these tiny towns. It can't possibly have that much. We also have lax secret police. I might want to do something about that. Yeah, they've just got some towers. I mean, this can't... They, I, I refuse to believe it's going to be that difficult. All right. I feel like I probably want to keep this thing back a little ways. This will move in. Uh, yeah, we'll keep it right at the edge of. Because uh, our our range has to be greater than their range because they've just got like little rifles while we've got the big guns. Oh, wait, wait, wait. They've got, like, little fly guys. Alright, so maybe, maybe we want, uh... This. To uh, come in here. Maybe it can shoot these guys down. You'd think, anyway. Of course, I could just tell them to it. Wait. We have Marines, right? We can board a ship. Or maybe we can't because we're not in range? Or, wait... We can invade, can't we? Because we've got the whole marine barracks. Or no, no, we were going to build one of those. We don't have the ability to do that right now. Gotcha. This thing is purely about shooting stuff. All right, so we'll, uh... We'll come in... We'll come in from this angle over here. Actually, you know what? No, I shouldn't do that. We should focus our fire in one direction. Don't, don't hit your own ship, buddy. You idiot. Don't do that. I might want to get a little closer, actually. So we can really lay down the fire. Yeah. Let's go to an outside view. Like, we should be able to tear this down in a timely fashion. Or so you would think. But yeah, once we disable the guns, then they are at our mercy. Okay, we're already low on ammo. Yes! But yeah, I mean, to be honest, with these, like, little cities, I should be sending in... Oh my. I should, with the little towns, I should be sending in, like, just, like, a swarm of marines to try to, like, rapidly capture the, uh, the fortifications instead of, like, blowing them up, because it'll probably be cheaper in the long run, seeing as the towns don't produce that much money. Uh, gentle takeover. Slow and gentle takeover or transfer of power that leaves the city mostly intact. See, that, that sounds nice. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to be a jerk. Because, you know, jerks are not cool and stuff. Alright, so we can move over here. Alright. 
So we have also, uh, yeah, we still got this city over here of Ulfar. What do we know about the city? I mean, it looks it's pretty big. I mean, if we had a massive uh, swarm of marines, we could probably just take over the buildings and then not have to blow everything up. Which I feel would be better than blowing everything up. That's just my opinion. We'll have to see if that strategy actually works or not as we go along. All right, in fact, let's uh, let's build another Deathly Wind. We'll call this the Penetrator, because why not? Because it penetrates stuff. Exactly. Um, also, I guess... I kind of want to move this so that our buildings aren't, like, too close to each other. Yeah, I'm going to move it right here, I think. Honestly, I'd put it right up there as well. But yeah, because this way, if a if the enemy, like, comes in between here, then it's going to, like, shoot at its own people here. And that would be good. I might want a land ship as well, eventually. But for now, we're probably okay. Also, I kind of wondered to myself, what uh, determines the income? Let's see, you have made and consolidated your first conquest. You are now ready to continue expanding. Capture city after city, fortify your conquests, and build up your fleet. Soon you will have united the world under your banner. So it's kind of like playing Risk, honestly, conquest mode, which is kind of cool. I like it. I mean, they've got a lax secret police. What do we know about this as well? So we can... We can increase it. Well-organized secret police safeguards your empire's security. A severe. Spies and informants everywhere. Every movement tracked with suspicion. Yeah, let's just go with this. That, that feels right to me. And that's, that's all we've got right now. I wonder if it gets um, even more complicated later. So this is what we've already got. Aerial tactics. Aerial core. Fire safety. That seems kind of useful. Got explosives, advanced explosives. Um, rif rifling, we've got optics. Gunnery, machinery. Where would I find flak cannons, I wonder to myself. Pressurized suspendium dust. Got a bit of land ships in there. Hmm. Let's go with wooden hulls first. So, yeah, if we want to be fast, then we're going to have to spend more money, I guess. Which seems all, all right. I mean, maybe it's maybe it's a little early to be, like, going that hard. All right, so let us move over here. We're not going to invade the city right away. But then again, it, it does have just, like, the one tower. So, you know what, we'll stay here. Oh dear. Didn't see you coming in. And we have no defenses. All right. We're not going to arrive in time. So, that's unfortunate. Yeah, there's, all right, we'll, uh, we'll just let them take over. And then we'll come in and, uh, yeah. Got to remember to... Do I really want to... Wait, didn't I have another ship? I feel like I did. Oh, here they are. I mean, yeah, maybe what I'll do is move these guys over here. And, uh... Alright. And we'll get these two right here to, uh, go board this guy. Because if we can take their ship without blowing it up, then... Or, you know, without doing too much. Oh, God. You are trying to board, right? Or wait, wait. I've got to get close. That's right. Okay. We're going to blow this up, aren't we? All right. I kind of want to control them separately. Yeah, that's going down. We're not going to capture that, are we? I'd like to, but... Yeah, it's not happening, is it? Wait, can I tell these guys to cease fire? Is that a is that a thing? 
Normal fire, focus on shooting, target ship. And yeah, if I just tell these guys to move. Oh god, oh god, oh god. All right. This is not going to happen, is it? It'd be nice. But I'm pretty sure this thing is uh, blown to high holy hell. Uh, guys? Guys? Alright, let's, uh... Let's get a little closer. There we go. Okay, I just had to get closer. I gotcha. Alright, the ship is ours. Excellent. Oh, right, and there's still the whole... All right. So we will uh, go up here. Oh, and that's it. Huzzah! So we've captured a ship. We have uh, saved our town. Move ship into combat area. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Um, is there... Is there anything I can do for this thing? Like, can I, uh... Oh, Lord. Um... Yeah, if I just, like, dig out a big pit... Okay, that's actually incredibly annoying. Um, I don't know, do I just, do I scrap it? I guess so. I guess that's all I can do. Also, the enemy fleet is moving to raid one of my cities. Pirate. Anyway, um, yeah, what we probably want to do first and foremost here, grab our defenses. We want to repair this thing. This is just a pit in the ground now. Jolly good. And, all right, that's going to be there. There is no defensive buildings. Enemy fleet is moving to raid one of your cities. They look like pirates. Is that all they are? Probably. All right. We'll do one more fight. Okay, we are uh, we're on an intercept course, right? Yes. Okay, good. Beautiful. All right. Gaslight versus the pirates. Oh god. There's two pirates, in fact. Okay, how do I want to do this? Oh, and the pirates are actually able to fly higher than I am. That is... concerning. Alright, so we'll do this. And also, like, this. And when we start, we can try to board these fellas. Alright. So, first things first, we want to move into a uh, position of this nature, like so. Okay, deserters and war criminals, preying on the weak. Wipe them out. Okay, hurry up. Come on, get ready to board. Oh no. Oh, come on, guys. I was right here. All right. You go there, you go here and also flip around. All right. Um, you can go down here. You know what, we might actually just end up blowing them up. That is totally conceivable at this point. I kind of wish the board order just made them, uh, you know, like, fly in as close as possible. Yeah, this is probably not happening. Yeah, because I can only give the board order and then move them. So I get well, I guess the smarter thing to do would have been to order boarding and then move in.
Yeah, this is... Oh dear. Might want to move out of the way here. We don't want to hit our own people. If we can help it. Okay, we're boarding. Please stop firing now. Alright, the enemy ship is ours. Hoorah! Alright. I mean, the ship's kind of... Kind of out of it. But it's good. Huzzah! We won and we captured a ship. Alright, let's see here. The, uh, pirate raider. Pirate raider. Let's, uh... Alright, so we took out the pirates. Let's, uh, let's... Invade... Let's invade, the, like, the small surrounding towns. I'm having fun with this. Alright, what are we looking at here? So we've got these guys. Alright, so we'll move our guys like this. If we can, I do want to try to just send in the Marines and then, you know, see what happens with that. Actually, now that I think about it, if we just move our guys further back... Yeah, then we'll let these guys, uh... Have first start here. All right, so we want you to board the ship. And then once you can move, you, we will have you move in. Oh god, and then we've got these guys coming in. All right, so we might want to move in a little closer just to be able to shoot those things down. If possible. All right. Actually, let's, uh, let's do this like that, and we'll let him start moving a little bit first, and then you can come in here. Yeah, because the less damage we do, the better, I should think. Alright, and if we need to reposition ourselves even more, we should be able to pull that off. All right. We are able to actually board the, this, right? That's a thing. I'm pretty sure. I feel like it should be a thing. Maybe we have to ground and... Oh, no. We are boarding. All right. There we go. Wait, which team's boarding? Is it both teams? Okay, we've taken control of the Watchful Readout. Okay, so that means... I should be able to take, uh... These guys. Let's, uh, let's lift them up into the stratosphere if we can. And we won! With almost no damages. We'll do a gentle takeover, because that... I'm a good and, uh, wholesome person, I think. Excellent, excellent. Oh, and we finished our research. Alright. Um, sure, Imperial Telescopes. We want to be able to see, I think, better, because that gives us better range. Anyway, I think this is where we should wrap this episode up for now. And when we come back in next time, we are going to take over Hesera, I reckon. But until then, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button, or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking, and I will see all you in the next video.